Hmm, is it working? Okay, hi guys, and uh, welcome back to some more Plague Inc. Evolved. Uh, we keep on playing this game, even though, um, I don't know, we are pretty much running out of uh, options here. I don't know, it, it just feels like there's been a long time since something, like, really good has uh, appeared, you know, like, um, oh, Drunken Peasants podcast, that might be, um, interesting but uh yeah there are a lot of uh scenarios coming on the new feature that uh have like very uh fangirl epidemic that are like very you know uh original i might say but the thing is that uh there haven't been any scenarios like completely change things like the anti-plague one was really cool and i really enjoyed it uh, or the neurox swarm aftermath and those ones but uh, apart from that, most of them seem, I don't know, maybe rather generic. Uh, we'll see. Uh, I mean, we have two more scenarios on the endemic features, and then we maybe can play some of the new ones. But um, anyway, uh, let's try the fourth plague. A horrific swarm of flies has consumed much of Egypt, leaving its inhabitants with a strange and deadly disease. Is this God's wrath? We shall see. Uh, brutal as always, the wrath of God. We don't get to pick up any DNA gene modification, that's cool. Infected by a plague coming from a massive storm of flies from the heavens, spread quickly and unleash the terror of the millennium to the world. Do not kill too quickly, okay. Mapping out everyone who has been infected by the flies will result in the plague not being able to infect the world. Bring the punishment slowly. I guess that's like standard. Wow, look at that! Egypt starts completely ravished. Look at it! Oh my god! And all the nearby ones start off right away. And obviously, we do get detected because I mean, uh, after something, an event causes four million people to die and a lot more to like, you know, get infected. I, it might be reasonable. Okay, let's see whatever we have here. Severity is quite high. That's unfortunate. Hmm. Oh, I see. These are from the bioweapon ones. We can also spread through beetles. For those of you who don't know, um, I'm currently eating some grapes. You know, just uh, just for giggles. Um, I guess some transmission would be fine. It seems to be very similar, and by very similar I mean almost identical to the bioweapon, except that you have the gnats and beetles instead of the other kinds of transmission and the fact that uh, I got detected yeah bioweapon type C and the fact that I got detected pretty much almost right away because of like how brutal it started uh, water number two gene compression number two this should take out all uh, lethality if I remember correctly how uh, then the, um, this plague is uh, working, you have to like uh, take out uh, the lethality using the, these uh, things like gene compression, uh, deactivate modifying genes, the gene compression and so on. I guess, oh uh, yeah, I remember I should have grabbed this and this, then this and this, then this and this. Ah, uh, I messed it up. Ah, uh, I made it up. Um, I don't think I'll be able to make this scenario because if you don't grab them that way, you know, the lethality goes up very fast and then you're screwed because you start killing way, way too fast. Uh, I really would like that water number two. There it goes. And then extreme biorassol could do something for us. Seven points. Let's see. This does not increase... Uh, decrease lethality unfortunately that's a lot of bubbles and I'm going to go ahead and pop every single one of them like the little seats they are holy shit we are spreading it didn't even get extreme bio aerosol should we even get it at this point I mean yes uh, we are better off with cold and drug resistance and yeah let's grab this final the uh, gene compression we don't we are trying to slow it down from developing extremely little symptoms. Wow, look at it spreading. I guess that's India getting infected. Oh, god damn it. I tried to press pause and I couldn't do it. There it goes. 
I think I missed a bubble. Which usually isn't shouldn't be that bad, but you know. Alright, uh, so we cannot grab any over there. So the lethality that we have at this point is pretty much you know it's permanent, we can no longer get rid of it. France leading global cure effort. Oh yeah, I should have paid attention to the cure that is going like uh, really fast now. But pretty much there's not nothing for us to do here. We're not going to be able to... Um, interesting. And uh, his bomb throwers in Colombia. That uh, did help out a bit, but not really good enough. Yes, I could just go for the uh, total annihilation. God's wrath, there you go. But... Yeah, it's very expensive and obviously I cannot get it, so uh, this has been a failure. Um, well, I think I know what to do. Mm, for the most part, I think. Yeah, yeah, cure research complete, everybody gets uh, rapidly cured. I don't know... I cannot even imagine what kind of logistical distribution system you'd have to have in place in order to cure billions of people in a matter of, like, what, a week, two weeks? Uh, just imagine how you would disperse all those vaccines. It's not realistic, but hey, let's not uh, get ahead of ourselves. There are many things that are not realistic in this game. Okay, let's try and go ahead. Can we, in any way, sh say, shape, or form, reduce severity? We cannot. Mm, four and five. All right, we can get get them. Maybe a little bit later. Maybe get this one. Yeah, we cannot decrease uh, severity, so we will get detected right away. As unfortunate as that is, um, as soon as lethality starts spreading a little bit, or like, or more like rising a little bit, I'm going to grab the second batch, like uh, gene compression and gene. Uh, what's this called? <laughs> oh my God! Uh, deactivate modified genes. And uh, no, I'm not infected by God's wrath. Don't, don't stop looking at me like that. No, no, what, what, oh, sir? I, I, I don't want to get into the quarantine, sir! Ah, I'm just kidding. You thought I was just being pulled off from the chair by, like, some sort of weird secret organization, right? Ha, ah, tricked you. Okay, let's grab these two. I think this is how you have to grab them. If I remember everything, uh, anything at all about Pagan Evolved. Still, the fact that we get detected right away is a very big bummer. We can also not include any gene modifications, so we cannot like give it a little bit of boost in like certain areas, or make it more resilient to the cure, or make it evolve symptoms on its own. All those things could be very beneficial, but unfortunately, uh, we'll have to work without them. Okay, here uh, starts. The here it starts rolling. Wants to start popping, you ain't stopping. Okay, extreme bio aerosol. That was a lot of points. And I'm expecting a giant outburst of the plague. That is not really a giant outburst, but uh, we can work with it. Cold resistance and drug resistance are both going to be extremely beneficial. Wow, we are infecting everyone very, very fast. Woohoo! Uh, call number two we'll get for now. Drug number two will follow up right away. You must be always on with your eye on that lethality because you do not want it to like get out of hand. See? There we go. Now we need to like uh, infect everyone. Uh, wow, United States really got it fast. Even though it didn't grab like drug resistance number two. I guess the extreme biosol makes its uh, place known. 
God's wrath. We've, uh, we are still killing, alright. So that means that all we have to do now is uh, wait for everyone to be infected and just unleash the wrath of God's... I don't know. I, I'm trying to like play the scenario here. We are spreading like out of control and we are getting also cured out of control. More like it. Uh, survival in cold and dry areas. Okay, we're going to grab that. And I think I might just go for it. 62 points is fucking ridiculous. I don't think we can get any more points. Uh, oh, oh, that, there we go. We, we have to grab it. There's no way for us otherwise. Alright, unleash the Armageddon gene. People will start dying now like they have never have before. We need to grab the genetic reshuffles. God damn it, we don't have enough points for this. Ah, we are going to get cured in like the worst time possible. Fucking god damn it. This scenario is hard, man. Hmm. We didn't really grab that many. We did kill a lot of people, but. Um, still not do. I I am not sure exactly what you're supposed to do here. I'm going to try it for one more time before I like give up on life and everything. But uh, it's uh, really a big bummer over here. Hot in urban areas. I don't know. It seems to work, but you know you do have the freaking start off that is very annoying. Maybe if I grab all these, will be better. I'll, I'm, I'm going to go with the, like insect transmission this time instead of the uh, air and water one. Might seem a little bit counterintuitive, but maybe it will work. Hey, do you have a lot more severity? And a decent amount of infectivity. Wow, we spread to the United States so fast. Nice. Uh, weird, but you know, it's quite possible if you ask me. I mean, all it takes is just a guy to walk on a plane, and there you go. Alright, that's uh, uh, insects, slight chance of infection from corpses. That is actually very beneficial. We must uh, make sure. How the hell did they get like. We have such a weird spreading pattern over here. Right, things are going swimmingly, and what we want now is obviously decompress the gene, grab uh, this, and extreme insect transmission, <laughs> and kill on rare occasion. Okay, let's let's pause this and grab all this, and let's then they get that, and uh, yeah, now we should like roll into infectivity. Look at that. The United States gets infected very fast. Seems unusual. There goes cold number one and two for the cold countries, obviously. Oh, I almost missed that one. Wow, look at the outburst of infectivity. You just click on a country, you know, it's like 20 infected, 50, 100, 200, 1000. And it and it just gets going, you know, it just never stops. Okay, I'm going to have those ready. I'm going to get those, 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 and uh, we are ready for the final outburst of the plague. CDC team to hunt patient zero. Wow, that's a cool event that I haven't seen in a very, very long while. I sure hope we are spreading fast enough. Yeah, I think we are. So let's just grab these, unleash our Mogadon. Uh, now people are going to start dying on the head. Look at it, look at it. So beautiful. And uh, we are getting points from it, which is very good. I hope people die. Uh, I mean, I hope we infect fast enough. Yeah, we are. No, no, don't even worry about it. No more healthy people left in the world, so we won. We won. There's nothing you can do at this point. You know. They keep trying with the cure, but uh, once you unleash the Armageddon team, it's all over. Genes manipulated. That might be in a 
brought it very close if I haven't got the genetic reshuffles, but uh, obviously I didn't take any chances, and uh, yeah, it was uh, it's a pretty quick and uh, intense scenario, I have to say. You have to think and act fast as the virus pretty much gets detected right away, and uh, yeah, for the most part it was uh, relatively fun. So see, we got to Spain, to France, to... Japan to South Africa to UK to the United States. It, it, it's really very fast. I know why it's because they haven't closed down their borders and airports right away in the previous two attempts they they did and that's why we couldn't spread so much. We had to spread by land. But now they didn't do it right away, which is very odd if you ask me and that that might have helped a little bit. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed watching this uh, small video. I'm trying to like make some quick videos because the CSGO tournament is coming up and I really want to see it. Maybe I can get a drop this time. Uh, see you guys next time. That I'm going to make. Yeah, rate it up. Subscribe if you want to see more and bye bye.